day for a lot of our tri-state cross-country teams as they came to Quincy in hopes to bring home some new hardware. Let's take a look at some of the action. At South Park earlier today, many of our local tri-state schools competed in the Raider run right from the jump. Quincy High's Olivia Schuring would take an early lead and Monroe City would be close to follow. A little later in the race, coming down the hill are the Lady Blue Devils running side by side with a decent lead out of all the other runners. But when it comes down to it, QHS's Olivia Schuring would just be too fast to handle. Olivia takes home first place with a time of 19 minutes and 55 seconds. Her teammate Kiana Scheifele would secure second place for the Blue Devils with a time of 20 minutes, 22 seconds. Senior Kiana Scheifele says it's a big deal that QHS took home first and second place today in the Raider run. That means the world to us. I just started running sophomore year and to ever think that I'd be here is amazing. And um, Liv, the girl that came in first, my teammate, she is amazing. But ever since I started running with QHS, she has been there by my side. And um, we share a lot of faith with each other. So uh, that's awesome to share with her. We had some technical difficulties getting the boys' highlights, but here's the final leaderboard from South Park. Bowling Green, Ben Chance with a winner with 15 minutes, 45 seconds. You see Quincy guys, Thomas Hess, taking home third place honors with 16 minutes, 34 seconds. And rounding out the top five from Clark County, Mason McDaniel with a time of 17 minutes and eight seconds. We have more sports coverage on the way. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this.